second story for you this morning. A missing class ring found more than four decades later. 42 years ago, Sandra Baldwin lost her Shawsville High School class ring. She thought it was gone for good, only to recently get a call that it was found. 10 News reporter Rachel Lucas brings us this great story. It's a symbol she wears around her neck. Is this my little my little hope? A motto she lives by and a feeling Sandra Baldwin is held on to that one day she might find her high school class ring that was lost 42 years ago. I lost it almost immediately in 76. She was a senior at Shawsville High School, then known as the Shawnees. At age 18, she went by her maiden name, Sandy Foreman. She worked as a maid just to pay for her class ring. And shortly after she got it, she gave it to her then fiance. It was gone. I was absolutely 100% convinced that it was down the New River. The ring was lost on a day trip at the New River in Eggleston. And it was never to be seen again. Or so she thought. Fast forward 42 years and two hours away to the Claytor Lake home of Ralph Patron, who passed away at age 99. Left to his estate, niece Gail Stowers found something curious. I was going through items at his house and found this box and it had the ring in it. How it got there, Gail says, is still a mystery. Well, it had the initials in it, so we started thinking about how we could find the owner. Determined, Gail reached out to staff at Eastmont High School, who tracked Sandra down on social media. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. The pair of strangers, still not sure how their fate was intertwined, met up to deliver the lost ring. It's so amazing. <laughs> it's crazy. Sandra was so excited, it just flowed over to, to me. Where it's been and how it got there remains a mystery, but for now, just having it is enough. I really appreciate it, and I promise I will do my best not to lose it again. In Shawsville, I'm Rachel Lucas, 10 News, working for you.